this is basically just one big forest road so about 50 plus k's of this when you're all alone i'm seeing the tunnel again cool no one by your side the crowd has gone away from here there's nowhere you can hide And all the lights have faded low And your town has shrunk in size I'll be there right by your side Through the lows and the highs Back up in Dorigo again, and what a lookout. How cool is the horse and that lady giving the young fella a ride, that's pretty cool. I wanted him to head that way. A bit more adventurous riding over there, but they didn't. But um, yeah, so back up in Dorigo, got a um, camping ride planned for this one. Gonna head over to, over Chilundi, and end of the Down Morton area. It's about 100 k's from here. Camp somewhere over there, not sure where. Probably go check out the uh, Grafton Tunnel. But we'll go check that out and find somewhere nice to camp and um, string up a whole heap of fun roads on the way back to Southwest Rocks. So that is the plan. But yeah, damn. Everywhere up here, the views are insane. Oh, All right, out of there. It was interesting trying to start the bike without scaring a horse, but uh, I was pretty calm, didn't freak out. Lifted up its head, went back to eating again, so all good there. When you're all alone again, no one by your side. The crowd has gone away from To fade it low, and your town is shrunk inside. I'll be there right by your side through the lows and the highs. Coming up to should be the Nimboida, the little was it little Murray River. Well, there you go, eh? Thought it'd be the Nimboida, but look at this one, mate. Beautiful. If I can set up camp beside something like this, I will be a happy camper. That's bloody nice. All right, we'll keep going down to 108 kilometers. <laughs> Alright, we're getting somewhere. Go down here a few k's and then turn left. I think it's called Sheep Sheep Station Road. Could be wrong. Take my hand these roads. No this is me, Sheep Station Creek Road, Guy Fawkes National Park. Too easy. It's funny, they still got their fires going. Yet today's definitely not what you call a cold day. Oh, beautiful little creek straight up. Wow, this whole region's awesome. 
nice swimming pool. Cool. Beautiful little creek. Just um yeah wow. Doesn't rain for a bit but they're all bloody flowing. Little camp spot down there. Wow, eh? Look at that little waterfall. Too nice, just too nice in here. So it shouldn't be too far now from the turn off up. You sort of go left and go up the hill up into Chalundi Road. Can't be too far. Don't think I've missed it. But so far it's a nice run. Look out birdie. <laughs> Alright. There you go, got the sheep going, got the cattle going. So it looks like just up here is a Chalundi turn off. This be me. Chalundi Road. Well, about the greater up here. Yeah, last time I come up here it was very stony and sort of wild well it was fine it was just rugged and I was on me rally actually and I um, I was on the stock tyres and I was, had this continuous fear of getting a flat tyre I just thought one of these rocks is going to go through it but um, yeah it was all good no dramas walk these roads there's no need to walk. Take my hand, walk these roads. There's no need to walk alone. It's a little bit cloudy, Bill. Let's have to see what we got. Well worth the 100 metre bloody side trail. <laughs> Look at that. Damn. Yeah, wow. Check out this one. Vista Point picnic area. Mount Highland Nature Reserve. Yeah, you know, good bit of info on that. There'll be all sorts of things through here, all sorts of walks and bloody places to explore. Go check out this. Yeah, so last time I was up here it was about oh, maybe two years ago. Or a year and a half or something like that but it was um it was in summer and it was hot and there was about a dozen fires through here so i've still got to go pretty well that way across all those mountain ranges for another probably 50 k's 40 or 50 k's so still a long way to go but there's um but when you come up here and it's and there's fires all through here and, and there's fires literally on the side of the road as i rode past them and i'm thinking i really shouldn't be in here Cause there's a whole lot of bush and there's not many ways out so you know it's windy and there's a few sort of fires just don't don't do it it's pretty calm when i went through well there's dow morton 
Actually, so there you go. So that way. 50 k's that way. Dow Morton's me. Yeah, he's got some height. Black Mountain, 1,259. Chalundi Mountain, which is that one there. You just probably see him. What's he, 1,380. So we're pretty well up there. We're definitely up there. All right. Yeah, well, a bit overcast, but still a impressive view. All right, staple diet. Actually, soy and ginger. Biscuits that are usually turned to crumbs. Bashed around on the bike, so look at that. A miracle. Full biscuit. There's some sort of section up here. It's a bit more like a, a bit of a flat plains area on top. So Chalundi's that way. I thought it was a bit more that way. So I'm not seeing where this area is, but... It's a long way that way. All right. Pretty full on looking, the old ginger. Nice, but a bit strong. <laughs> cool. No, cool. So this is basically just one big forest road. So about 50 plus k's of this. Bit of a climb coming up and pretty well at the top now. I think it's a bit of a marshy sort of area up here, eh? Bit of a high plains, flat sort of, I don't know, Barrington tops looking section. <laughs> it's pretty well what it looks like. Yeah, this area is different, eh? A different bit of country up here. I guess it was um, sort of cattle country. The rest of it's sort of national park. Yeah, there you go, cows. Right on cue. Look at that little swamp there. Cool. Very different. Having a little swamp up here. Another one over there. Another one there. Oh, yeah, right. Finally, <laughs> wow, that's a solid run across there. Here we go. I see the first lot of people I've seen for a long way. <laughs> He's going good. Where are you off to? Yeah, I heard that. Yeah, yeah the sign that. back there saying it's um blocked 16k's up here. That's right. Yeah. Okay. You can still ride through the tunnel and head up and turn around, but they've got bollard um like some Okay. Off. No worries. Yeah, I'll go up and have a look at it. Yeah. So where are you going to do now? Um, we're just going to head out back 
back out to the um, in, the other road, the Bishman Road, and then head back into Grafton and up to Jack Adley. Oh, okay. On the river. Yeah, yep. Just bang in the ground. Cool. Yeah, mate. Right. It's yeah, no. It's, Oh, I come from Southwest Rocks. Yeah, okay. Yeah, wow. Oh, there you go. I lived at Southwest Rocks for 30 years. Yeah. <laughs> Kempsey, eh? Yeah, yeah. I'm seeing the tunnel. Cool. <laughs> Last time I came in here was at the rally. This bar is a little bit louder than our rally. All right, pull up somewhere. All right, we'll go check out this tunnel. This is um. Pretty impressive bit of engineering back in the day. Cut through solid rock through necessity just to make it a, a shorter run. Um, yeah, to the coast lies a long way either way. A bit sloppy. But um, we're in it. Like right the bat cave. <laughs> ah, that'd be crazy. Trying to imagine the hardship involved. So it's sort of wrongly called the convict tunnel. It wasn't dug by convicts, it would have been a government type job where um, you got paid very little. So there would have been some money involved in it, public works sort of job. But uh, you couldn't pay me enough to do this. Yes, it's through necessity. Oh, the roof's just notice the roof dripping. Just slowly dripping through the roof. Sketchy. Alright. Might send the drone out and have a look from uh, sort of the water side of it. You can't get much of a view. But, uh, yeah. There was no way around it, so we'll have to have a look at that way, I think. We'll send her out. Yep, that's the plan. I'll probably go back to Down Morden. Camp near the bridge again. There's lots of spots down there, but I like my little bridge spot. Be able to send a drone out later. Send it up the river. Alright, back in my little hidey hole. remember exactly where it was somewhere in here I think it was around here somewhere also I got some gardening to do
son of a river to help you fight. Yeah. Beautiful spot. Not one person anywhere. All right, let's go up into or through the old town of Down Morton. We're not mustering the cows, we're just checking out the old stuff. Yeah, <laughs> we'll go just past this one. This one here, I think it's got um, yeah, got little hooks in the roof. There's a bird on that M1. Looking pretty comfy. Just, oh, he's gone. Just for hanging stuff, hanging meat, I reckon. Drying it out. So there would have been a few shops here. Bloody gold rush, I guess, is there reason for this town she gone all right let's head east Whew. no bad change of plan when you're alone again no one by your side The crowd has gone away from here There's nowhere you can hide And all the lights have faded low And your town has shrunk inside I'll be there right by your side Through the lows and the highs camping up here about a year ago and these blossoms were um, just about well they're in full bloom then and they're heading that way now beautiful tree cherry blossom I think I worked it out but um so these ones are almost in full bloom so it must be pretty bloody close to the exact time I was here last year good looking plant and good looking area like Look, damn, look at this. Even without the sun on it, it's still amazing. Just about back to Tar. Beautiful run through there and a beautiful morning. Might just pull over the old bridge here. There's actually a free campground here. Why? Just why would you cross the road now? <laughs> oh, anyway. Yeah, this, this spot down here is actually another free spot to camp. There's one dude over there in a caravan. Dude in a ute. But we'll uh, check out the carnage. You can see those metal things are there, the old pylons from the bridge. They've been well and truly flattened. <laughs> Look at them, just barreled. You can tell how old they are by, they've got rivets. Cylinders filled with concrete. Absolutely hammered by the floods. 
pretty old school. Big bit of water down here, eh? A lot bigger system. But flogged, they could take no more. All right, guys. That might pretty well do it. I'm gonna head for home. Probably go to the tar. Got a fair way to go, so he's all downhill after this one. I will catch us on the next one. Cheers, guys. Take my hand, walk these roads. There's no need to walk alone Cause I know you You know me Hand in hand we we'll take these streets Cause I know you You know me Hand in hand we we'll take these streets